Okay, the silent one. finish. One, the rhinoceros. Okay. Good test. Okay. Uh, okay, are we ready to read the Dunk Food book? The book about the meeting cat? Yes. Okay. <coughs> Daddy! What? Kill me, Daddy. See, something to kill him just blow him away. That's it. Or let him go. He's probably gone by there. He just blew him away. He's got so, having a chili house. The the burn sign bears? The burn steam bears? Yeah, Why are you eating crab? Why are you eating crab, Dad? Okay, let's read it and find out. The barren sting bears and too much junk food. The Berenstain Bears and too much junk food. Healthy food is good for brother, sis, and dad. Help your mom make them stop eating food that is bad. Berenstain Bears and too much junk food. But this, daddy? Dum, 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 you see the tree house? You go to house, you to yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. There's some squirrels right here. We're, and we're eating healthy food. Look, we're just eating some nuts. You want to have some? Yes. Okay. Let's see if you see that. I'm a rabbit. I'm down here. I'm trying to get something from this flower. Ah, I'm the mama up here. Look, I've got tomatoes and there's apples and there's... Mmm, I'm hungry. I wonder what I'm going to eat. Bear country, where the bear family lived in a big tree house down a sunny dirt road was a happy place and a healthy place. There were lots of cozy nooks and comfortable trees for the bear country folk to live in. And the weather was good most of the time. It was nice outside. Ooh, such a bad particular. And best of all, there was plenty of good, healthy food. Worms and seeds for the birds. Nuts and acorns for the squirrels. Grass and dandelions for the rabbits. More than enough flies for the frogs. And plenty of good food for the bears. Honey. Most important, lots of fruits, vegetables, milk, fish, and The trouble is... Get closer, Dad. Look at your eyes. You're going to get sick. The trouble was that certain bears... Which bear am I think looking at? Which one? Where are the bears eating? Right yeah, brother and sister bear. Why that? They had a bad habit. They Why were, bear? They would watch television. Bear! Bear! Yep. The mom is happy. No, the mom's kind of a little nervous. She's, she's, you can see she's, she's kind of like this. What's going on? What's happening here? So the kids are eating bad food and watching television. No, daddy should do Look, you'll see. You see. Look. And then they were eating bad food at the movies. And then bad food out at the... Borschfest. And the mall. In fact, it began to seem to Mama Bear that any time was snack time. So they didn't have a special time. Like, oh, they did a lot of work. Oh, it's a party. They just eat. They were eating it all the time. That's a problem, Sis. At first, she, Mama didn't really pay much attention. It wasn't a big deal. But then one day, when the cubs were ra raiding the pantry, they were looking through all of the stuff there. Mm, come on, let's eat. Mama noticed something. They were getting... And they put those good food. Oh, last night I ate them. 
Popcorn is good if we make it in the house, but if you're popcorn. yeah, popcorn is good. But if you're eating it out, um, like at the movie theater, they put lots and lots of weird margarine type of butter on it. It's 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 not really healthy for you, Susie. So the the her, she was looking at her bo boy and a girl and thought, well, they're getting a little chubble wubble, but not in a good way. So she took a closer look at their bodies just to be sure. Yep, they were chubbier from the side, and they were chubbier from the front, and they were chubbier from the back. There's no question about it. Brother and sister were going to have to stop eating all that junk food. And they're going to get fat and fat and fat. Yes. But Mama, they protested. We're growing bears, and we need those snacks. You're growing all right, said Mama. The trouble is, you're growing from side to side as much as you are up and down. Sometimes cubs get into bad habits, and you've gotten into the habit of eating altogether too many sweets and goodies. Mom! Look at their faces. Mom! We're going to have to get back to healthy, nourishing, good food. She gathered up all of those sweets and candies into one big look. Mom, Mom, what are you doing? What are you doing, Mom? You're not going to throw them away, cried brother. No, we're going to put them in the freezer and forget about them. And there's no use in arguing. Don't fight with me. And that's when the dad came in. Look, right here. Yes, that's right, agreed Papa, coming in from his shop. There's no use arguing with your mother when she's made up her mind. Then, looking into the refrigerator, he said, Oh, dear, we're out of sweet sea cola. Like Coca Cola. Let's be sure to get some the next time. We're at the supermarket. Our sweet C cola days are over, said Mom. It's finished. As she pushed all of those sweets into the freezer, two packages fell onto the floor. Say, shouted Papa, what are you doing with my sugar balls and cocoa chunks? They're going into the freezer, and we're going to forget about them, cried brother. We're going to eat healthy, nourishing food instead. Now, just a minute, said Papa. But as he leaned to pick up his, look, he's bending over to pick it up. There was a big rip. His pants ripped because he has such a big butt when he's trying to do it. So, so Papa's Papa Bear's snack habits had caught up with him. He split his pants. Ooh, what kind of healthy, nourishing food are we gonna eat? What, what kind of good food are we gonna eat? Papa asked Mama as she sewed up his overalls. Vegetables right out of our garden, of course, and fruit from our orchard. <laughs> And what are we supposed to drink? asked Papa. Try this, it's called water. It is water, just drink water. The next day, the Bear family went to the supermarket to buy some sensible food for the pantry. Mama pushed right past the sweets and goodies and stocked up on whole grain bread and cereal and fresh milk and cheese. Then she chose some fine looking oranges and bananas, two fruits that didn't grow in her orchard. Look at that. Just now they got some Uh oh, what's he doing up there? Okay. Yep. 
And look, what do you think the mom is saying right now? Don't eat crap. While she was waiting in the checkout line, someone said, Oh, I'm glad to see that cartload of nutritious food, Mama Bear. It was Dr. Grizzly, the bear's family doctor. <laughs> you must believe in good food for a healthy body. I certainly do, said Mama, but I'm not sure about the rest of my family. Dr. Grizzly took a look at Papa and the cubs. Hmm, I see what you mean. They look like they could use a little professional advice. Stop by my office tomorrow, please. Oh, no, we have to see the doctor. <sighs> the cubs were nervous when they all arrived at the doctor's no, 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 office. No, 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 I don't think so. But with Dr. Grizzly, you never knew. Step in here, please, said Dr. Grizzly. There's Dr. Grizzly up here. Right here. Oh, boy, movies, the cubs said. And they saw a projector and a screen. Not exactly. We're going to have a little slideshow. About what? What are we going to see? What are we going to see? You'll see, you'll see. Good food for healthy bodies. Now, this right here is what your body looks like from the outside. And this, she said, changing the slide, is what your body looks like on the inside. Wow, said the cubs. Our bodies are a marvelous system of parts called Organs. Everybody say organs. Organs. Man, man. Organs. Uh, organs. 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 Okay. Sisu. Sisu say organs. Organs. Okay. And it's these parts working together that let us do all the wonderful things we can do: climb mountains and sing songs, hit home runs, ride bikes. Ride scooters, play with our toys. It's a number of systems, really. A system of nerves that let us feel things and think things. A system that keeps blood flowing through the body. Blood mobile. A system of muscles and bones that let us move and give us strength. And a system for food that, yeah, that's great. that guys digestion is the question. Where's the ice cream? No, he didn't say ice cream, he said x ray. Ice cream? Not a spray. X ray. And a system of food that lets us take in the nourishment that gives us energy and keeps all the other systems healthy. The last slide showed different kinds of food and told how they helped the body. Papa looked for sugar balls. And where's my... Papa was looking on the chart. He sees a chicken. He sees milk. And he sees bananas. And he saw some bread. Oh, but there's no sugar balls or cocoa, chocolate, chewy chums. They were nowhere to be seen. Now, said Dr. Grizzly, turning to... To, on the lights. I'll do my best to keep you healthy if you promise to do your part by eating the right foods. We promise, said brother, but sister had a question. What about sweets and goodies and snacks? What harm do they do? Do they hurt us? Most of them do, yes, answered the doctor, and they aren't very nourishing. Instead of helping you build your body and strengthen your body and make your body strong, that bad food, it just makes you fat like this. He took a pinch of, look, he pinched Papa's waist and he got a handful. Ouch! Why that? Because he's showing them how fat he is from all of the bad food. And even worse, they fill you up.
so you're not hungry for the food your body really needs. As the bears were leaving, just a minute. Oh no, she's going to give us a shuka. But that wasn't it at all. Exercise, called the doctor. An exercise program is important for good health too. And it'll work off those extra inches. So they, they need to do some sports now, Susie, if they want to look really good. Well, okay, there's no time like right now. Let's run home. And off went the cubs with Papa puffing behind. Hoof, hoof, hoof. Come on, let's run. Run. This is good sports. We're doing some great sports. At first, it was a little strange eating just good, healthy food. But for a while, they could almost taste sugar balls cocoa chums and chocolate chody chody chum that they weren't snacking on. But mama was always ready with healthy goods. Good food. Apple slices from television, nuts and raisins from movies, frozen yogurt at the mall, crisp crunchy carrot sticks, just about any time you want. The bears, yeah, they're gonna run, look. The bears started a family program of jogging, running, and exercise. So when the Bear Country three mile run was announced, they were all slimmed down and ready. Though they didn't win, they didn't come in last either, not even Papa. And they won a prize for being the only family to finish the whole race. They were excited and proud, especially Papa. I know what. Let's have a little celebrate. Let's have a party by opening up the freezer and... Speak. Dad, have a carrot stick, said the brother. And some nuts and raisins, added sister. Whoop. Mm. Yes, that's what I was going to have. And Papa did. The end. Mouse. The Mouse. guys. The end. The end.